This my friends is my very first all grain, the Smash, the Warrior Smash uh, 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 American Pale Ale that I did. And as you can see, it's in a Heineken glass. It's relatively clear. I mean, it's a little cloudy, but it, it, it uh, let's see what we've got on the nose. Oh, the anticipation, the anticipation. Right off the bat, I've got the Marisotto grains, the malt uh, coming through, and um, yeah, obviously the Warrior hops is coming through. Because I've never had Warrior hops before, and um, this is interesting. It's 6.5%. The IBUs were about 70. 70 IBUs, which is quite a lot, but it's a 16.5 alpha acid, and it's a very mysterious hop in that it comes across on the paperwork as a really high hop bitterness and etc. But it is quite smooth. It it doesn't, as my home brew store guy said, Jared, um, it's bitter. But it doesn't make your mouth pucker. It doesn't make you go, oh, oh shit, that's bitter. It's it's a, a nice bitterness. Anyway, we'll get on with it because I'm actually brewing an all grain at the moment. I'm just getting my strike water up to temperature. Oh my god, that is so freaking beautiful. I, I, right up front, I get the bitterness, I get the, um, the hot bitterness straight off the bat, like I did a, 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 a 20 grams for, 20 grams of Warrior for, uh, 60 minutes, 10 grams for 45 minutes, and 10 grams for 30 minutes, so, because it's quite high alpha acid, I didn't want to scare myself off of hops. And um, it's, uh, I, I have to say, I'm very, very impressed with my very first all grain going as well as it's gone. You kind of get, you kind of get a, oh, it's hard to describe, it really is, it's a, an oaky, woody, um, piney, or not really piney, but it, it's its a woody sort of a flavour in the beer, if you can understand that. Yeah, I would say a woody, a woody type of a, a, a flavour. Yes. There's not a whole lot in the aroma side of things because I only used 40 grams and my last edition was at 30 minutes. Like, uh, when I do this again, I'm going to brew this again. I think I will go 20 grams, 60 minutes, 20 grams, 45 minutes, 20 grams, 30 minutes, and 20 grams flame out, 10 minute hop sand. Um, because I think that that'll bring the hops out a little more or I might even I might even do the same recipe but not a smash but make it like maybe 20 grams of centennial or cascade at flame out just something different but that marisota grain is a beautiful grain and uh, I'm gonna finish this beer on cam and then I'm gonna get off to brewing cheers drink good beers 17.